I got a juice, 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 juice,
What inspired you to venture into fashion and how do you balance with working in your music career? So the name Ambitious came from me being an ambitious person. Every time someone would ask me what's three ways I would, I would uh, three words to describe myself, one of them would always be ambitious. So that was a vision that I had for a long time and I felt like I wanted to bring it to life. Um, my cousin, manager, best friend, Moni D, she definitely inspired me with fashion. Um, Cause growing up I would be a tomboy and then like, I would say junior high school and high school, college, she got me more into like fashion. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do this, ambitious, we outside. What I did with this t-shirt is, it's basically a reflection shirt. So the name is backwards. If you take a picture, or you look in the mirror, you can see the actual brand ambitious. Fine. And I feel like the way I juggle it is just um, time management. Um, when I have time, cause I wanna expand as well. So when I have time for my fashion, I have time for my fashion, I throw in my music and I just balance it. <laughs> That's crazy. I like, of course, you're a Virgo, so I can see you're. This is not it, clearly. What other avenues would you like to venture into? Um, acting for sure. Um, I got casted for like one episode in the show. It might be out soon, so look out for it. Okay. But I definitely want to get into acting more. I want to get more roles. Um, a little bit of everything. I definitely want to expand my brand and fashion. And I actually do art as well. That's like a little hidden talent that I have since a, a youngin. So I, I honestly want to get more into painting. Yes. Okay. <laughs> All right. We got the little basics about you, but I want to have fun. All right. Okay. <laughs> Let's get it. Fun. <laughs> Here I still got the juice. We have a show segment called Pick Your Poison. Ooh. <laughs> I am going to tell you two scenarios, mm. and they are both just out of this world, terrible scenarios. <laughs> and you're going to tell me which one you would go with. All right. Ready? <laughs> yes. Let's do it. Let's do it. A BBL, but the thighs don't match, mm. or one year with a missing tooth, and it's in the front. No side tooth. I am going to take the BBO, but the thighs <laughs> don't match. <laughs> you going to make it match later. Period. <laughs> Living in a house with no Wi-Fi, just food for a week. Or living in a glass house with no clothes for a month. I'm sorry, I love clothes. I'm gonna do the Wi Fi. No Wi Fi. No Wi Fi. So I, I won't wifi. see you all live. Like, I'm sorry. We're just, yeah. not, <laughs> we're just not gonna talk. I'm like, not sorry. <laughs> I need my clothes. It's feeling, it's feeling wavy. So Period. we're just not gonna talk. I'm feeling feel wavy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Would you date a rapper that's facially handsome, mm -hmm. has no kids, mm -hmm. but in real life, he has halitosis. Mm. Or date a man who has perfect credit. He's a CEO, multi millionaire, has one kid, but he doesn't support your music career. I'm gonna go with the CEO, the one kid, and all of that. You feel me? But he doesn't support your music career. I know, but I can support my music career. We're gonna find other supporters. You feel me? <laughs> So make sure y'all have your front teeth and y'all, you know, brush your tongue. That's yes. what she's saying. Brush yes. your the back. Yes. Um, next question. Bring a butter knife to a fight with 12 little people or go to a rooftop party, but all the people there are your exes and they came with their favorite snacks. I'm going to go to the rooftop party with all my exes because I love me some snacks. And I'm a flirt. I'm a little flirt flirt. So it but is what it is. Been with fun. You've been with them already. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you going that? you right. I mean, we got to go forward, not backwards. But that sounds like fun. <laughs> <laughs> it's giving Virgo. Yes. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> so... Before I let you go, because I don't want to let you go. Mm, I don't want to go. 
What can your fans look forward to in this coming year? Any new projects on the horizon? Yes, I'm working on new music. Um, might turn it into an EP, but more music is coming soon. Um, I'm definitely working on more fashion. Look out for me on that upcoming show. You know, I'm gonna announce that soon. And definitely more shows. So yes, just be on the lookout, all right? We wavy, we outside, catch the wave, catch the vibe, period. You girl, flower guy. <laughs> okay, before I let you go, Flower God, tell us why you still got the juice. So, I still got the juice because I always had the juice. I was born with it, you feel me? So, once I got it, I never lost it. It ain't going nowhere. And that's for everybody. Once you have it, listen, you always going to have it. So, don't let nobody tell you different. Still got the juice. Always got the juice. You feel me? One with the juice. Yes. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's a wrap for Flower God.